Hello everyone and welcome to another Smart Arts Weekly Challenge video. My name is Jake and today I'm going to be attempting the second weekly challenge prompt for this October, that word being toxic. Alright, so before we get consumed by radioactive waste, let's get into this drawing. So when I was thinking about the word toxic and what I was going to do for my drawing, I almost instantly thought of a crazy bioweapons scientist. I really wanted to have a lot of green toxic slime in this drawing. I started out with him holding the flask, but I decided it needed more, so I added the two barrels of toxic waste. And there's so much toxic waste it's even on the floor. I really thought it would just bring out the crazy even more with him just standing there in the toxic waste itself. I mean, if the crazy scientist look doesn't come out enough from all the slime everywhere, just look at that one big pupil. That's sign enough you may want to avoid this guy in a dark alley. So when it came to the coloring of this piece, I decided to start with the colored pencils to really start to build up the basic colors for the scene. Throughout the piece, I am mainly just laying down browns, greens, and reds to really get that base layer down. Now I am super happy with how the slime turned out. I used a light base of the teal colored pencil, and then I came over it with the lime green color, and then I added some yellow later on with the pens to really make it pop. And same with the red, I made a lot of base colors with the red, and then I came in again with the red pens to really make those reds stand out more. But there's only a little bit left to finish up, make sure you stay till the very end and see the final results. Alright everyone, our completed piece using the word toxic. I think this thing turned out really cool, but let me know what you guys think down below. Now don't forget about the other weekly challenges for this month. If you don't know where they are, check the back of your brochure, you'll find them right in the bottom there. And make sure you subscribe with notifications on so you don't miss videos like this one where I try to tackle them myself. And if you guys enjoy my work, make sure to check me out over at my personal channel over at Naughty Egg Draw. The link is going to be in the description. But that is all for today, everyone, and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye!